I first started uh, playing soccer and I fell in love with it outside York Gate Mall, right across from the Jane and Finch field. I got to ask to join and um, yeah, the rest is history. Football honestly drives our family for it. My parents are from Ghana, so that's the, the biggest game sport in Ghana. It was like the focal point growing up. At first, I felt like I didn't want to go to university. I thought I could go straight to the pros, but honestly, if I could do it again, I would do the exact same thing that I did. I'd go to Akron. The Super Draft was I feel like very good, but also very nerve wracking at the exact same time. And welcome to the main ballroom in the Baltimore Convention Center. Thankfully, I think I went seventh, I think it was. So I didn't have to wait too long. Orlando City SC select midfielder Richmond Larea. The first moment I, I realized I was a professional would have been walk into the Orlando City locker room and I'm about to start videotaping. I look up and it. Kaka was right there and honestly looked like he was glowing. So it was, uh, it was a cool moment. I have a tough time removing myself from the situation I'm in, but I think now with my son, he, he allows me to realize who's at the games, who I'm playing against, stuff like that. When we played against France, for him to see me playing against Mbappe, I come home and he's like, oh, like that, that was so cool. Like, you know, just things like that. So it puts things into perspective now. I think I would tell a kid just like I would tell myself at that age to just keep believing. I think this country, there's a big belief in soccer and football right now. So anything they are dreaming about, they, they can do it.